Hey, Picks and Parlay family, it's me, Detroit Lenny, here with a free NHL pick for you guys for Tuesday, February 6th. We're going to talk to Oilers and VGK, and to do that, we're going to bring in one of our top handicappers over the last six years, Scott Rickenbach here. He's going to bring in, let me bring him in here. I'm bringing in his name. He's Scott. I'm Detroit Lenny here. Uh, one of our number one handicappers overall the last six years here on picksandparlays.net. Going to talk a little free action here for the hockey. Edmonton Oilers minus 130. Traveling to Vegas, taking on the Golden Knights. Everybody's in Vegas. Super Bowl, right? Uh, Edmonton right. is as well. Total sits at six and a half. Scott, where are you going with this one? What a great matchup and what a great story that Edmonton has been 16 games in a row. Uh, for those of you that don't know, the longest streak is 17. So Edmonton is almost there. Uh, it's just been a phenomenal run for them. And what might surprise people when you think of Edmonton They've been so strong in terms of scoring goals. But Lenny, try to guess how many goals uh, on average they've allowed over the 16-game the, the winning streak. <laughs> You're pretty close. Oh, only, only one and a half goals, which is ridiculous. Edmonton, for the longest time, you know, they've got so much skill with Connor McDavid, Leon Dreisaitl, just uh, uh, Nugent Hopkins for years have, have helped this team to be so dominant in the offensive zone, but their problem has always been goaltending amazingly one and a half goals per game during the 16 game winning streak. And of course the scoring is still there and Vegas did lose at Edmonton earlier this season. So a lot of people might look at this and say, well, this is a revenge spot for Vegas, but guess what? Edmonton doesn't has not forgotten that their season ended last year because of Vegas on the way to the golden Knights winning the cup. Vegas, uh, excuse me, Edmonton was bounced in that postseason series, but they played really, really well. There were a lot of games that could have gone either way, and Edmonton right now is just playing at a different level. Believe it or not, the Golden Knights have lost 11 of 20 games, so they're not exactly on fire right now. And the key with this, I just want to talk about betting value for a minute. That's the key. When you're riding a streak like this with Edmonton, 16-game winning streak, if they were playing a really poor team and they were at home, I mean, the price would be 400, 500 on the money line. We've seen those kind of numbers. So here's a chance where you get some value on the road. I think it's just almost impossible to pass up, uh, not taking a look at this. You have to take a look at this 16 game winning streak and laying about a 130 price on the road. I'm, I'm back in Edmonton here and looking for them to stay red hot. Vegas will give them a strong game for sure, but there's just no way to go against Edmonton right now. I want to take the over here, but because of Edmonton's defense, you just can't. You just can't do that in any game here. I think Edmonton squeaks this out. I think they get the record at the end of the day, looking forward at their schedule. Um, I like Edmonton here in Vegas, becoming a winner here uh, in Las Vegas during Super Bowl weekend. Uh, coming yes. Up. Coming up. Super Bowl week, I guess they call it now. I'm not even sure. Uh, this is a little free action here. We're going to take the Oilers on the money line when they take on VGK. Don't forget, you're looking for Scott's premium plays, uh, best bets, stuff like that. Everything you're making money on over on the site, picksandparlays.net is where you need to go. Use this promo code LENNY. That'll save you 20% off at checkout. Till then, Edmonton on the money line is where we're rolling. Scott, we appreciate you stopping by. As always, I'm Detroit Lenny Picks and Parlays. Good luck, everybody. Bless your Thanks again. so much, Lenny. No problem, man.